What's up and welcome back! Or if you're new here, hey, I do Bible reviews pretty much every single week. So if you're interested in that, you can go ahead and hit that subscribe button right now. And anyway, let's get into today's video. You saw that intro. You see the title of this video. You know we're about to unbox some Alabaster products. Let me give some background. So, I mean, there's not much background, but there is a little bit. I ended up uh, seeing their products on social media. I thought they seemed really interesting, a very unique way to read the Bible. So I went ahead and reached out to their team. They ended up sending me a message back. They asked me what I wanted, so I got some stuff. I'm not gonna tell you exactly what it is yet because I'm gonna unbox it for you. So let's get on the desk and I'm gonna open this box. All right, here we are. And as you can see, I am about taking up all the real estate on my desk right now. I don't have the biggest area, so yeah, um, bear with me on that. As you can see, this is how the box came. So alabaster, creativity, beauty, and faith. Scissor. I don't have like a fancy knife or anything like that. Last time I used like a little tiny um, like Swiss Army knife, <laughs> but we'll just go with a scissor this time. Since also I don't even know where that is, honestly. <laughs> oh my gosh! Okay, I thought I did it wrong for a second. Hopefully this is a nice unboxing. Ooh. I'm going to go ahead and read this. It says, The oldest story is one of making. God created, God made, God formed. Our desire to create is an imprint of that story designed into the fabric of our existence. And then here you see, well you will see, every thing that I got. So this is the book of Exodus. It's the soft cover. And I'm going to unwrap these in a moment so you, you can get a good look. Got the spine. Alabaster book of Exodus here on the back. I got Gospel of John. And then this is a hard cover of Psalms. And then here is the big one, Gospels. some branding. I'll go ahead and open these up and then I'll get back to you in a moment. Okay, I got all the plastic off. Now let's talk about why I chose these particular editions. So I wanted to be able to show you guys the soft covers. So I chose one from Old Testament, one from New Testament. And then I wanted to be able to show you a hardcover edition and also a different translation because these single book editions come in NLT, whereas the Psalms and Gospels you can get in NLT, you can get in ESV, and you can also get them in KJV. So I asked for Psalms in ESV. Now, they didn't have ESV in stock. So what they did was they ended up being really awesome, honestly, and sending me Psalms in the NLT, but then adding the Gospels in the ESV edition. So I didn't even actually ask for this edition, but they sent it to me, which is really cool. This is also a hardcover edition. So that was really awesome. So let's go ahead and, and uh, I'm gonna move these over and take one at a time here. Okay, so let's go ahead and take a look at this soft cover Exodus. So this soft cover that these come in is very nice. It's a matte finish like sort of coating that's just very smooth to the touch. Let me open this up. We have alabaster, and as you can see, this is just a kind of a regular cardstock type of paper. Well, I don't want to say regular. I don't, I don't know what type of paper this is, but you, you can see it's not a uh, a glossy paper. And then you'll have your copyright information right here. As you can see, it's printed in Canada. Founded 2016, it's in the NLT. Then here you have an artist introduction to Exodus. Then you get this Book of Exodus title page. Very nice and clean. Then look at that. Just like a two page spread of photo. 
<laughs> no, it's very, it's really nice. It's really nice. I think that's what it's just meant to be like an inviting way here. Like, oh wow, look at that, look at that. This looks just like a really nice location, right? Like, I'd like to be just chilling right there on that rock. But uh, yeah, this is just. I've seen photos of these online, and I've never had one, so. It's really nice to see, and it's really just comfortable to look at, right? And I think that's the objective. It's unique, and it's just welcoming. And um, here's your look at the text. So you can see that bold section heading, and this chapter number up here. And then you see the text. Very nicely spayed out, spaced out and uh, readable. And then you have your verse numbers in there. They're just very light and faint because I, you know, I think it's just meant to be a comfortable reader, but you still can utilize those verse numbers when you want to. And then you can see the text like jumps around, so it was on that side, now it's on this side. Now it's a square. Get some more photography. Now, now you got two column. You know, you got up at the corner, down at the bottom corner. Really unique. Very unique. Now you got a tall column again. Double column squeezed. So yeah, this is just, it's really cool that you got more photography. This is, it's really comfortable. It's just like, I think this is meant to just have, you can have this on your coffee table, you know. You could, I mean, but it's not necessarily just for that. You could, you could throw this in your backpack. If you're going through Exodus, you could throw this in your backpack and be like, anywhere just reading and it just like it feels nice right it feel it looks looks really good and look at all this i don't have time to flip through it all even though i'd like to wow okay and then let me make sure there's nothing like different at the back so you just have those a couple of photos looks like a a list of the team members, photographers, models, and continue the conversation. And that's that. Wow, so it's really nice. So um, let's go ahead and grab John, even though we know that this is another soft cover. I'm just going to quickly show you, like, you know, that it's following the same concept. I would assume. I mean, I haven't opened this one yet. So you have this. So, oh, so you got gray, right? That's different because Exodus had blue at the front, so you can see that they're changing up their designs a little bit here, their concept of color and stuff. So they have an artist introduction to now the Gospel of John. There you have the same type of title page, which is very nice and clean. And now you're having new artwork, so look at that. Really nice, really like artistic photography, like people who have an, a knack and an eye for photography, really. So, um, because I, you know, I probably would not take photos that well. <laughs> look at that, a square, like who would have thought, but it's still like a good design concept, right? So here, look, this one started, started with a double column, more double column, double column. Does this one stay double column? I wonder now. Oh. Oh, okay. <laughs> I was going to be like, okay, well, I guess it doesn't always change. This one just happens to have more double column happening, but it does have variety as well. So, yeah, same thing here. Nice. Now, let me grab the hardcover Psalms. But look at this. If you take this off, Look at that nice cloth over board. Really, really nice. So it's gray. So now this color's, uh, this looks, is this a lighter gray than the John? Let's see. This looks like, is it this? It's this, I think it's the same gray. I think it's the same gray, okay. I'm just like, oh, but look at that. 
Look at that, it's getting changed up. Okay, I like it, I like the variety here, so it's not always consistent. You know, you're looking at different visuals. It just uh, stimulates the mind a little bit differently, right? So you have your copyright information here. As I said, I did end up getting the NLT, and here is the artist introduction here to Psalms. We got the green book of Psalms. Wow, look at that. So it does follow, you know, the verse by verse format format for the poetic setting. So let me just do a quick flip here. Okay, and then last but certainly not least, we have the big one, <laughs> the Gospels. And this is uh, going to have that same, I think. Yeah, look at that. Wow. Very, very nice. These hardcovers. It's cool that they took the time to do those details, you know. It's tan. So this one's gray. It's gonna change of colors. Is it gonna change of colors? I don't know. There's a copyright on this one. The Gospels. And here you have a table of contents. Gospel of Matthew, Gospel of Mark, Gospel of Luke, Gospel of John. Look at that. Ooh, navy blue. Artist introduction. And there we begin again. Look at that. So there's actually no photography after the you know the first couple of images. You have just two pages of text, double column. So that's you know, it's really nice to see this variety, constant variety, constant change in imagery. Just makes things comfortable and fresh. Now one thing I was curious about is the, um, so let me go to Book of John. I know we just looked at that, but you know, I'm gonna just flip through here for you so you can quickly. Whoa. But what I want to look at is if it's the same, right? Um, because I'm curious if it's the same as, so it does look like it. So remember that raindrop is photo. Yeah, so these are the same photos. Because remember, this is ESV. That was a soft cover, single book edition, NLT. So I wasn't sure if it was going to change. See, on that white square, that tells me right there. So they use the same images then. It's the same sort of formatting in this Gospels edition as the single um, book edition. So. If you had the single book editions or this full Gospels edition, you would have the same content, or at least photos, depending on translation. If I had the NLT, I would be have the same content. Yeah, very nice. Wow. All of these, really. Look at all that. Wow. Thanks again, Alabaster, for sending me these to review. Um, let's pop up here. I'm going to talk some more. Excuse the lighting in this room. I literally ran out of all the daylight while I was filming on the desk and now I'm just blasting this on my face. So I'm hoping the visual comes out okay. But let me talk about these alabaster products here. These things are very nice. They're really quality. You know, even these soft cover editions, like just the way they have this kind of finish and they're very clean, it's very inviting, very nice. They took the time to make these, you know, they, they took their time and they made them well. They've made a lot of additions and they're making more. So it's like um, a really unique project and a really fun way to read the Bible in my opinion. So if you want to check these things out, I'm going to have a link in the description below to Alabaster so you can check out all of their products. They have all kinds of different things. You can buy single book sets, you can buy all kinds of different collections and stuff like that that they group together so 
check it out. And actually right now they have a Black Friday sale going on. So you could get 25% off by using BF25. That's no commission to me. It's just something that's going on right now. So if you're watching this video in the present time that I'm posting it, then you should check it out and, uh, you know, see if you want something. All right. I'll see you guys next time. Peace.